Hey guys, what's up? I just wanted to show you this video of my little Japanese black pine little seed tray. And as you can see, it's doing very well. Uh, I can see from the bottom of a colander, these are planted in a colander, that the roots are very active because of the weather. I don't know if you can see there. But yeah, they're starting to move after the, like I said before, non-existent winter that we've having. Uh, we've been having here in the tropics so uh, I'm very happy for this now the next step for this will be to pot in individual little pots so they can continue to grow as I said this is 100% uh, turfish yeah I've found that when you start seeds it's better to use a very you know neutral uh, substrate when it comes to pH because of uh, some uh, some plants having a preference of you know neutral pH uh, and uh, when it comes to pH they don't like some of them they don't like very acidic soils so that's what I found with these and uh, I actually perform a little experiment to tell you this and as you can see here we have another one that I just started that I recently started a couple of weeks ago and again, it's planted in like 100% uh, turfus. And we can see that the results are very evident. Yeah, so 100% turfus, black pines. Uh, how to germinate this? This is very easy. Uh, it's very, very easy. You just have to soak them in water for about a couple of hours, you know, two, three hours. And then you just plant them in 100% turfus. You put them in the sun. Uh, and you water uh, like two or three times a week and that should that should be enough to get your little seedlings started they are very very cool it's very very easy and it's something that you can try at home and in a couple of years you have many many little Japanese black pines of your own to start as bonsai to grow as garden specimens so give it a try I just wanted to share this quick video with you if you have any questions comments or advice please share them with me by dropping a line in the comments until next time bye bye